What's good? It's your boy TRNT, and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a highly anticipated album. I'm talking about probably the album of the year. We don't know yet, but this is Beyonce Act 2. So I reacted to Act 1 with my homegirl. Unfortunately, she was a big Beyonce fan, so she gave every song damn near a 10. So this time, it's just going to be me and y'all. So um, unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I know I'm late, but unlike them, I do not skip the song. I do not pause the song. I listen to the whole song, and at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from 0 to 10, 10 being the best. So if it's a trash song, that's 5 and below. If it's me, average okay, that's a 6. If it's a good song, depending on how good y'all think it is, that's a 7 to 10. So we not gonna cape. I'm from H-Town, just like her, the same neighborhood, Third Ward, but I'm not caping. I'm keeping it all the way honest. This is a real reaction. I've been waiting, so let's get to it. This is Beyonce, Act 2, Cowboy Court. Making going on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. <laughs> this one called I'm Most Wanted or Two Most Wanted. I don't know. It's she been putting a lot of double eyes in the albums. All because it's two, so it's two eyes. Okay. I'm most wanted. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking. That's my song. I'm in Texas, South Houston. You right on my side. Don't jump in the gun, little still Molly, okay. Molly Cyrus on here. Oh, this one called Two Most Wanted. first talk about I, I i realized i ain't know if it was called i most wanted or two most wanted because she using a lot of double eyes but it's subliminal as for two i get it but i ain't know if it was i or two that one actually meant two most wanted and 
she featured Miley Cyrus. You know what I'm saying? And thinking about, like I said, Beyonce, she's a Houston girl. You know what I'm saying? Texas girl. And she collaborate with a lot of people. Like, she told us that she loved country music. You could just think about her music videos. Even when she did collaborations with Lady Gaga. Y'all remember the video, Lady Gaga Telephone? That shit was hard. It was a big hit for both of them. It, it was, they both was at the peak of their career. Miley Cyrus, this song, well, well I'll say it that just to say that this song could have been written for her and Lady Gaga. And it would have made sense. Like, if Lady Gaga was on this hoe, it would have still, I would give it the same grade because no offense to Miley Cyrus, but her and Lady Gaga both can sing. And they both can sing country music, country tunes. Even though I know Miley Cyrus more country than Lady Gaga, but Lady Gaga could have did the same song, the same justice. But I think Lady Gaga in an acting bag right now. So she, I think she not, the timing not right. But Beyonce, she still had this record. She still wanted to do it with a white girl or a country girl. Somebody who can bring this whole alive and she, she picked the right girl, Molly Cyrus. You know what I'm saying? Like, if y'all around my age, I ain't gonna tell y'all my age, but I had a little sister, man. Shout out to my little sister, Pierre, man. I love you, sis. But um, I, I had a little sister, man, that grew up with the Molly Cyrus. You know what I'm saying? AKA Hannah Montana. My sister, look, I ain't trying to embarrass her, but she had the Hannah Montana pillows. The beat, <laughs> the bed spread, <laughs> the posters. <laughs> I was like, I, I thought my, it was, she had so much Hannah Montana. I thought my sister thought she was white for a little minute. I was like, sis, you know, Hannah Montana ain't real. <laughs> but, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't fucking with her musically. I knew she did country music around that Hannah Montana time. But, it wasn't until she made Party in the USA. They still play that in certain clubs to this day, Party in the USA. And then when she started fucking with Juicy J and then they shouting her out in hip hop songs and made her the, like, the hot new thing. We can't wait till she turned 18 type of shit. That was some creepy shit. Like, nigga can't wait. That's another story. But anywho, um, Miley Cyrus did cross over to the black community and she made, and then she went back to the, she started dating the Marvel nigga, the, um, Thor brother. She wasn't dating Thor, but Thor brother, she was doing some like marriage, I don't know, type shit. And then she went to, after that marriage ended, she started making some good music, like the Wrecking Ball song. It, it would have been a dope song regardless if you like Molly or not. But Molly matured. She got a, she definitely can sing. She got, she talented. And her and Beyonce, this is another hot take. So I'm saying this shit right now. Molly Cyrus is going, whatever this tour, Beyonce Act 2 tour, she got to bring Molly now. Now this is a time for her to go, on, I think Molly going to be the opening act. But she's going on a tour just to solidify her country shit. She going to go do this. She going to have Molly open up. Molly can do all her country hits. Molly can do all her other hits. Warm the crowd up. You dig? And um, Beyonce come out, do her thing, headline shit. And bring Molly back out, do a standing ovation type shit. But I think Molly going on tour with this cop. Um, whenever this tour, the actual cowboy tour, the, the cowboy Carter tour start, Molly is going on tour. I'm calling it right now. And even if she don't go on tour, Molly popping out on spot dates. When they come to New York, the big cities, Molly popping out and they doing this record. And I made this video so long, I, I will really run this back because this is the first 10. Even my I don't even know what app this is, but they said that they like this song. They were saying Miley Cyrus. I was like, I ain't hear Miley Cyrus yet, but I heard on this one. This definitely a 10. This is my favorite song on the night. I'll be a hating ass nigga. I talk too much for not if I if I didn't give it a 10. 
You know what I'm saying? I will run it back, but there's so many songs on this album, and we got to get through them all tonight. You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all subscribe. I'm live on Twitch right now, so if y'all want to add y'all gray, man, let me know in the comments, bro. Uh, click the next video if y'all rocking out with me and Beyonce. If not, I'll...